should you buy SanDisk Extreme Pro Portable SSD for your video editing and storage? Maybe you will know the answer because I already have three of them. Let me show you why, but before I'm going to show you why, let's get to the sponsor of this video. I'm joking, I don't have any sponsor. Bruh. Let me talk about this very super nice portable SSD. First, you got a lot of choice in this portable SSD realm, I mean realm, right? Such as the T7 Touch T5, Samsung T5, this one and maybe like the build D SSD and a lot of it. But I have do a lot of research and I even got this one and T7 to do a comparison. If you guys interested, maybe hit the subscribe button and but I have to tell you this guy is super awesome. First, this is the version one, the V1, the V2. It claims that it has like two thousand read and write. <coughs> but if you got going to reach two thousand, you need USB three point two something, right? But this day your normal laptop even the top tier apple device doesn't have that 3.2 so the max you're gonna get is this 1000 read and write yeah so let's do a speed test in black magic as you can see the speed is up to what they claim to be Unlike those like the build the SSD where you got like 30% less than they claim which it's bad and I didn't I didn't do not recommend it but the SanDisk one it's very fast and I'm going to show you when I transfer like two three hundred of gigabytes in files and it's super fast <laughs> like if you try this with your normal sata drive such as those that are like spinning disk inside like um the one that is like two terabyte for for 30 bucks it's something like that the price if you try 300 gigabyte it will take you like one day to do it so and this one took like as you can see it's not much and it's super fast that's why that's number one thing <coughs> i mean that's one thing that i recommend it to you and that there is more thing that you should know about this one so the next one this guy is water resistant water and dust that's mean you could take this to your field trip or to like do a uh, video editing outdoor in the sun or do it on the beach that sand in the forest etc like this one has so much potential but I, I didn't tell you to go swim with with it but I mean if you are in the rain and your back is like full of water from the rain this should be okay yeah that is very good and I'll do the comparison with T7 touch maybe in the next video because that one is I mean it's good for the fingerprint protection but not good for going outdoor so this one take advantage on that and the full comparison will be more in the future and let's talk about the security in this drive it doesn't include any like physical security that you can protect your drive with but you 
it comes with the software which is super complicated and it doesn't work for me it keep kicking me out of the program when I try to do it it's like lock the files in there and when you move the folder that is contained the files became corrupted and you have to reinstall and everything that sucks so I got three of these I got the one terabyte one terabyte and two terabyte yeah the I think it's maybe this one felt thicker than this one when you like have it in hand maybe like inside is more thick and kind of a little bit heavier as well and it's when you um, do a heavy heavy file transfer this one it's hotter I don't know why maybe because it's like more storage inside the same yes same body this one is hot too but the good thing is it has those heat ventilation like metal bar thing here so it's kind of get cold very quick when you stop working from it and this one is fast enough to do 4k video editing from the drive itself i do it on final cut pro with my 4k footage and it works pretty nicely i mean i i got a little bit of like lacking but i'm on the prefer quality over performance in final cut yeah pretty good and if you're using apple device you don't have to worry about anything because this guy came with two usb um, cable it's all usb 3 the c to c and c to a so this one is c you can just do this and plug in and if you use ipad like me you can also you can also plug this in and do this to your ipad and you're good to go you can read the files of the ipad and this is some of my 4k footage you can see you can play it like straight away with no lacking in this with with this ssd which is pretty cool i i do a toy unboxing channel too if you guys interested i'll leave the link in the description is all about hot toy star war marvel everything very versatile for your usage so in conclusion i do really recommend this sandis extreme pro ssd you you don't have to go and buy the new one that claim to have 2000 read and write speed because you don't need it trust me this one is fast enough and that one the price on that one is kind of much higher too if you want to go that one you can go with the I think it's called Thunderbolt SSD. That one is super fast, but and also super hot too. Not the game super hot, but it's yeah, super hot. Thumbs up if you like it. Subscribe if you loved it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay safe, guys. Peace.